Hi guys, Trinity here, and thanks for watching my channel. Today's video is going to be about spirit guides. Now, everybody has at least one spirit guide. Usually we have many. Usually they're born with us. They're with us from the time we're born, excuse me. However, they can pop in and out of your life as needs be. Some examples of ways that you have already connected with your spirit guide that you're unaware of. They can connect with you telepathically. Um, they can connect with you through clairaudience, clairvoyance, pretty much through all of your clairs. Your inner self chooses, or your higher self, if you will, chooses your very special, very unique spirit guides before you are even brought into this universe, this world, here, this realm. Um, after they have chosen your guides and you're born, they stay with you generally, the ones that were with you then, but there are others. So, some examples. Um, let's say you're in the supermarket and you are walking down an aisle and you're not sure if you're out of like pickles, but you're like, you know what? Let me go back and check. Call somebody at the house, whatever. Nobody answers the phone, so you're like, screw it. I don't need the damn things, whatever. And you keep going. You get home an hour later, you go in the fridge, there's no damn pickles. And you're like, son of a bitch. That was your spirit guide trying to pop in, even for something stupid and so trivial like that. Yes, they will do that from time to time. They have interrupted my schedule more times than I can think of. Um, it's very distracting though when you're driving and sometimes they'll throw something in my head like, um, you know, a, a picture of a palm tree. And I'll have to actually start thinking, is this a memory from when I was a child or a movie I saw or a vision from a past life or something I'm going to be seeing soon. It's crazy. And by the way, you're not alone. So when you start feeling like you're going nuts because you're getting messages and you're not sure what they mean, and sometimes they'll even come in dreams, um, you'll start getting these messages and be like, all right, either I'm losing my shit or somebody's trying to connect with me. Um, I don't even like to tell anybody about it. I'm telling you guys so you know because you may wind up thinking, oh shit, I'm losing it. So I'm just making you aware you're not losing it. Um, I mean, I'm not a doctor or anything. <laughs> there may be some of us that actually are, but let's face it. Okay, anyway, just kidding. Um, so, spirit guides will make you feel a little bit like you're losing your mind sometimes because they will slip a message in there and you will have no idea what it means. And then suddenly an hour later, a week later, a couple days later, you continue to see the same kind of scenario over and over or picture or animal or whatever. So it can be very confusing sometimes when you're trying to figure out if it's a spirit guide. Um, but it's been my experience, I have seen flashes, like guides will show me a flash of something and I'm not clairvoyant, but they'll get it through to me that way if I'm not picking it up with one of my other senses. Um, my strongest one is claircognizance. So messages come in is sort of like a data download, um, but I also am clairaudient. I have not exercised the other clairs that we all have, because we all do, but the more you use them and you exercise them and you can learn about that, there's a wealth of information online. Um, but anyway, different exercises that you can put yourself through so that you are more open and opening your chakras and such. Um, anyway guys, I just wanted to make this video today to let you know that 
there are spirit guides surrounding you. Um, there's at least one, but probably more. Um, they will pop in and out sometimes at times of great grief. Sometimes when we need a change of pace, a different job, um, different relationship, whatever it may be, um, they will pop in. I've had times where people are having a conversation about a certain subject around me and I'm kind of lost in feeling like a third wheel because I have no clue, <clears throat> excuse me, allergies still, no clue what they're talking about and I feel like all right, let me just kind of sneak off this way, right? And a spirit guide will bump in and start downloading information and I'll start spitting it out before I even know what I said or how I knew it. Um, so, <laughs> sometimes it's a little bit alarming. Um, but anyway, if you would like to learn how to connect with your spirit guides, um, I'll give you a couple ways. One, try to meditate and get into a quiet place. But most of you that are watching this video, I'm sure if you're watching spiritual channels, I'm pretty sure you know how to meditate. But if you don't, there's lots of videos on it. Um, I've never done a guided meditation, but I will if I have to. Anyway, get yourself in a nice meditative state. Ask your guardian angels um, spirit guides to come to you and make you be more spiritually aware, more open to their higher level um, and frequency. Make sure you say only higher frequency beings can communicate with me. Okay? And after you've done that, you can say, you can alter it and juice it up to your flavor but you're going to say something along those lines and I promise you you will start seeing signs if you haven't already which I'm pretty sure you have because we all have um, some of us will be able to get the names of our spirit guides through meditation um, they'll be able to maybe even see them or hear them more clearly when you actually start to pay attention to something, it starts to glow more and make itself more visible to you. So really expand yourselves, expand your minds, and just try to go with the flow and relax and be calm and centered and you will balance and you will be able to hear, feel, see, know, Okay guys, um, if you like these videos and you want more to come or you have something specific that you want to know about magical practices, uh, meditation, tarot, um, pretty much herbs, crystals, put it in the comments below and let me know. See you later guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.